Sieht mir nicht aus, als wenn dieses noch lange hält da, dieses. Gucken wir uns erstmal um, wenn wir uns umgucken dürfen. Okay, hier geht es dann nicht weiter. Wir in die scheiß Richtung hier. Okay. Viel umgucken ist hier nicht. What the? Ja, lass mich auch los, du blöder Affe. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around yeah. these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to uh, what get you is, free. Uh, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah. Yes. Sorry. I just could use some sleep, you know. Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any any moment. But yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Okay, don't worry about me. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but... Well, we're in it now. It's what we got. We just... We just need a plan. You no know, way to get you and, and everyone. Luke! Oh, sorry. Sorry, shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. I'm not sure I can. I think they're really strict about that stuff. Well, you gotta try, Clem, okay? It's really important that I get one of those. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see you. Go on. Get out of here. <clears throat> the hell were you doing? Huh? Answer me. I was looking at comics. There's a whole store full of them. Yeah? No oh, shit. You best not dawdle, girly. Pull something like that again and you'll be meeting the back of my hand. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now! Ja, wir wurden ins Büro bestellt. <lacht> Oder wie? Das jetzt gerade verstehen durfte. Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. So, you should probably go. Also Bill mag es nicht, wenn er wartet. Wir sollten also rasch zu ihm gehen. Rebecca. Also du bist mit dem irgendwelche Leiden zu. Ich bin nicht mit meinem Kind in der Welt zu sein. Geh in hier. Alvin? Alvin! Er hat passiert ein paar Tage ago. Er kann nicht hören. Kein Sinn, dass er eine Rakete macht. Lass ihn gehen. Bitte. Warum würde ich das tun? I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Now.
You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will. And weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. Hey, you're a murderer. You can try and call it something else. But I know what it is. What it really is. Listen, Clementine. It ain't murder. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. You understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock. To keep them safe, it's their nature to follow, not to lead. Vas-y, ma. I know. I have to do everything for them. It's exhausting. Of course it is, but that's the role you're meant to play, and we're more alike than you think. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye, kept your nerve. That's what we need if we're going to get through this. The next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. It's not your baby. It's Alvin's. Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. All right, now... Well? There? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Try really knock the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything. Gerade ein Blick umgeworfen auf die Technik. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Yeah. Okay. Fragt mich jetzt nicht, was ich da draus folgern soll. Auf jeden Fall ist der erste Tag erstmal rum. Cuz we all know this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is going to do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up. How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just got to figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying. But uh, sure, what, what, what? Sound, sound draws walkers. There was this girl, Molly. She used bells to control where they moved. Yeah, that's right. She had him running all over Crawford. We just need something loud. Well, unless you've got a megaphone tucked in your pocket, it doesn't help us much now. I still vote we get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Oh, come on. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? Look, Clem had it right. We just need something loud to get their attention. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just got to get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. 
The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. We should get the radio to Luke. It doesn't hurt to have more information. I agree. Fine, fine. We can do that. But the herd is still what's gonna get us out of here. Maybe Luke can tell us where it's hitting from. Okay, so we get that turret radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. Ach nee, guck einer an. Du willst auch jetzt drehen. I ever hear you say and it's just some crazy stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell and rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. I've done it too. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Okay, wir sollen uns immer mega vor das Walkie Talkie besorgen für irgendwelche Aktionen und ähm, ja, wir sollen irgendwas mit mit äh, Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so Mit, ja, ist er Lucky, Lucky oder was? Der uns vorhin in das Comic-Geschäft reingezogen hat, da. Luke, ja. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. It seems pretty flimsy. This plan? Yeah, I agree with that. Clem, it's you or nobody, so you're nominated. We got to get that rope down. Mike, you want to boost her up? Come on, kid. <coughs> Don't let go. I got you. So. Da hat ne. Okay. Ah, und jetzt hochziehen. Okay. They're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you not in your bunk, we're all done. Also auch Stacheldrahtzaun Shit, reingemacht. He's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. <lacht> Oha, da sind we're viele Weiße. Vielleicht müssen wir uns mal... In the parking lot? No, not in the parking lot. I can't see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking up. Scheiß abgeschlossen. So you're not sure? What, about how many there are? Yeah. How can I be? Fuck. I hope they pass by us. God, yeah. You think we're ready this time? I don't know. Bill thinks we are. Of course he does, but he thought the same thing last time. We learned a lot since last time. So Not enough, though. We'll find out if they turn this way. Yeah. Der hat uns von da oben nicht gesehen. Oha.
Gehen wir mal zurück, vielleicht haben wir was übersehen. Da können wir, glaube ich, vielleicht irgendwo... Oh, guck, da können wir runter. Gut, da hinten wäre es jetzt echt schlecht gewesen, runter zu gehen. <lacht> Was machen wir einen auf James Bond? Ah, da unten sitzt die Bewachung. Da sind Walkie Talkies. Und für die Kommunikation mit Luke, glaube ich, müssen wir uns da mal eins besorgen. Aber ob das nicht auffällt, wenn da eins fehlt? Ja. 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 So. So really, no bullshit. You think we're ready? I think so. The homestead at least. I'm not sure about the expansion. They're out there and just moaning. Schön leise bewegen, Clem. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know what you mean. You figure we'd be used to it. Okay, sie ist unten. Wow. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. Das eigentlich, also ich hätte danach geguckt jetzt. Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the new people in. Steve, hard not to call the prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had the materials before we started expanding. I don't know about you, but it seems like we really shouldn't be doing this yet. Should we just wait until we need more space to make more space? I don't know, Hank. Bill's got a plan. Look, let's say we call it for now. Night. We'll talk later. All right, talk to you later. Yep, later. Out. Out. Ach, jetzt so hast du mir einen Pfeiler oben. Ruby, ihr seid doch bekloppt, ey. Oh, ba. Das fällt doch nicht auf, wenn wir zwei mitnehmen, ne? No. Oh Mann. Oh Mann, ist sie schnell, ey. Wow. You can't be smoking back here. Vince, come on. Don't give me that. If Bill smells a whiff of smoke back here, he'll flip. What are you thinking? You know what? I'm just gonna tell him. I'm not letting someone else get blamed for this. That's bullshit. Vince. Vince, come on. Vince. Hm. Hä? Richtig Ablenkungsmanöver. Vince hat aber hätte schon mal ein bisschen eher kommen müssen, aber vielleicht wären wir dann aufgefallen. So, jetzt haben wir die Walkie Talkie schon mal. Wow. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. Danke fürs Fangen. Well? Got him. Hm. Wir sind gut. Everybody stay where you are. No need to draw on suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Thanks. Yep. What? Yep. Anyway, get some rest. <laughs>